I don't want to say like computational models will never do scientific discovery or invention. They might, we might be able to make models that do that. I don't think the, the LLMs as we know them are the right kind of model to do that right now because they are, they are so heavily trained on just what humans did. What they do is they interpolate. They yeah. don't extrapolate. They don't say, right. hey, what if, right. what if all this that I learned that I digested is incorrect and there's a different way of yeah. looking at it? And then here's a new idea and I'm going to simulate that forward yeah. and think about, oh, that would explain the data in a better way. Yeah. They, they, they're just not architected to do that. I had a, a, in the book, I have a story about one of my friends who I think of as one of the best living inventors. His name is Rodney Mullen. And Rodney the skateboard champion? is the skateboarder. Yeah, He's famous for skateboarding because he invented almost everything you've ever seen a kid do on a skateboard. That's right. Rodney grew up in rural Florida, kind of like I grew up in rural Alaska, No, comp just the Apple II. He was in rural Florida. He didn't get an Apple II, he got a skateboard. <laughs> and so Rodney was stuck by himself at a time when there was no one around him who skateboarded. He didn't ever see anybody else do tricks on a skateboard. He had nothing, no one to inspire him. He just had to figure all this out himself in his driveway by himself. And so he became the most prolific inventor of things you could do on a skateboard. And you could say skateboarding isn't important, but kind of like country music or something, like a lot of people are actually quite inspired <laughs> about skateboarding. And so Rodney is an inspiration to them. But what's amazing is Rodney will have an idea for a thing that's never been done on a skateboard. He'll spend a year just trying to make it work He'll get it. YouTube video goes up. Two weeks later, kids in Kazakhstan are doing it better than him. Yeah. That's the moment of creation. The word creativity, you create something. The world didn't have it before. You created something. And even if it's just a skateboard trick, that's creativity. And you could see it in Jimi Hendrix. You could see it in, you know, uh, I don't know, like Jonas Salk. You could see it in these people. And I think that we need to find a way to have a, a better, more mature relationship with that, celebrate that, f search for these people, you know, support them, help them. 